Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to another one. Uh, I'm going to be honest. I've been putting this video off for a very, very, very long time. Why? I am not comfortable making this video because it involves going to a public area and looking like a uh, mentally unstable person if you don't know what's going on. So, today's premise of the video, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take some pigeon decoys, some duck decoys, and some goose decoys, which are very similar, if not oversized, of what a actual bird would, you know, be. And what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna put them out at different yardages, and I'm gonna show you what they look like on a GoPro and on a shot cam. But because I figured, uh, you know, a firearm in the middle of town on a school property would probably be frowned upon. What would you say this is? Uh, the moss stick? But anyway, so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go and I'm gonna take these decoys, I'm gonna set them out at different yardages, I'm gonna show what they look like through GoPro, because a lot of people, they're, they watch videos that they see online and they see a goose get shot at 30 and it looks like 60. Hopefully this helps you guys kind of understand uh, some of the different yardages, why stuff looks good on camera, why some stuff doesn't look good. Uh, hopefully it will help you understand some of the videos more. But enough talking, I'm gonna mix some hunt footage in. That's my phone. Okay, so I brought my dive bombs along. I've got pigeon decoys, I've got duck decoys, I've got goose decoys, I've got cameras. There's a guy here that's you know doing what I should be doing and running around the track. I'm pretty sure he's gonna be wondering what in the world's going on. But let's go do this. Well, walk of shame. It's locked. Well, okay, so this is my third field to go to. Uh, well, everyone knows where I'm at. If you're local, you know exactly where I'm at. Uh the first one, locked. Second one, locked. Third one, not locked but there's no hash marks. I was really looking forward to, you know, actually putting them on, you know, the 10 yard line, the 20 yard line and so on. But you guys are gonna have to set up for step offs. I have about a three foot stride. Should be pretty close. We'll figure it out. It'll give you guys a good idea if nothing else. So uh, right here is where we're gonna film from. We're gonna march that way. I think we're gonna put the first one at 10 and 30. You know, the second batch at 20 and 40, so on and so forth. You guys get the idea. Let me get these out and let's get going. 7, 8, 9, 10, 18, 19, 20. Okay, so I stepped it off out and back and it came out pretty even within a half a step. So I apologize for it not being absolutely dead on exact yardage but it's gonna be pretty dang close. So, as you can see, we have the pigeon silhouette, the duck silhouette, and the goose silhouette. That's 10 yards. How far away does it look? Crazy, right? Those there, 30 yards. Looks crazy far, doesn't it? Anyway, so here's some footage of ducks and geese or pigeons or whatever, uh, hopefully getting crushed. I'm only a bit in crush footage uh, of birds getting shot at similar yardages, I think. Or just birds getting shot. You guys can tell me, you know, how far away does it look? Getting the old shot cam out also. That way we can get that footage on here as well. Sure. Kill him, boys. Both of these are green wings. Really? Yeah. Here they come. Maybe back. Oh yeah, here they come. Eh. <laughs> yep, here they come. I can only shoot one more. Catch it! Oh!
That one landed. I can't take my eye off this bird, but uh, there's the one Tristan shot about hit me in the face. The blue one wants to die. Now that we got that done, let's move them out to 20 and 40. Okay, 40 yards, 20 yards, filming station. I'm done, guys. These GoPros, they make stuff look like you're shooting from outer space. Not everything as it seems. So that's the main reason I want to make this video. Just because uh, there's a lot of people that do comment. You ever decoy, Skybuster, blah, blah. I'm not saying I'm not guilty of some of those things. I'm just saying, I mean, come on. That's 20 yards. Hold on. That is 20 yards. That is 40 yards. I mean, look at that. Let's look at that shot cam and then let's look at some more footage. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> Yeah! Oh, that felt good. All right, there is 20 and 40. We're gonna go to 30 and 60. 30 and 60. Though, look how good these guys look. You guys know the pigeons, at least you should. The ducks, I didn't use these much last year. I plan on using them a lot more this year. And these, these are my favorites. Actually, okay, that's a lie. These are not my favorites. These are the V2Fs. The V2FFs, the fully flocked ones. I only have five dozen, but man, they're beautiful. I love them. Anyway, this is about the size of a goose. Here in Kansas, we have lessers. They're small geese. That is accurate. Obviously, if you're hunting honkers, they're gonna be a little bigger than this, but I don't hunt honkers that often. So while walking out here, uh, I realized I said 60 yards, 30 and 60. It's 30 and 50. 30, 50. Yeah, so anyway. I don't know why. I hope you guys like this video. If you guys do, you guys know what to do. Um, I don't even have to tell you guys. You guys, you guys already have heard it often enough. But let's get back here. Let's see what it looks like from this distance. Uh, we're gonna look at some more shot cam footage. Then we're gonna look at some more hunt footage, and then we're getting out of here. Okay, get in line here. There you go. Thirty and fifty. Look how far away that looks. Obviously, when there's a big cloud of geese coming in, it looks a little bit closer because there's a lot of them. You can see them better, but that's a long ways off. You're at the naked eye. You can see them plain as day. No problem at all. Little GoPro though, doesn't tell that story. 
do like being able to do this from my phone. Hope for the, oh, low battery. I had to. He was looking for me. Just for fun, because I see these numbers pop up a lot, I'm gonna put them at 80 and 100, just because I can. So, uh, the first one is 50, 80 and, you know what? Let's go 60 and 100, 70 and 100. Final answer. So, uh, by me stepping it off, this is 100. We are way further than 20. Uh, by my steps, we are easily 10 yards shy. So this is actually probably closer to 90, but to keep it true to what I've been stepping off, we're gonna leave it at 70 and 100. Uh, if you guys wanna come out, if you guys want me though, to come out here with a range finder or actual marks, uh, drop me a comment, tell me if I need a redo, if you guys don't believe me, if you think this is crap. Uh, but this is gonna be 70 and 100, approximately. So yeah. Let's go look at what it looks like, if you guys can see them at all. If you guys do like these videos, if you wanna see more of them like this, I'm planning on doing some shot testing, some patterning, some stuff like that. I do have a few of those uh, videos in mind. I do wanna try some different loads, maybe some different chokes. Not sure exactly how I'm gonna plan it out yet, uh, but I got a couple things in mind. If you guys wanna see those, I would deeply appreciate a thumbs up, a like, a comment, thumbs up, like, same thing. You guys know what the deal is. Because, uh, yeah, you guys see the 70 and 100 ish yards out there? Yeah, rough, isn't it? Let's look at it on shot cam, and then I don't have any 70 or 100 yard shots. Uh, so you guys are just gonna have to settle for more footage. Give me that blue, baby! Yeah. Woo! That is sweet! Look at that! Oh, so excited! Oh my goodness, dude. That was fun! Dude, was they did awesome. sick! Oh, oh, that was good! <laughs> okay. So, there you go. Now you guys kind of know how actual actual i feel bad about putting this as actual how stepped off footage looks it's short if anything else so anyway i'm gonna pick this stuff up uh i got some footage to sort through because i don't actually know what clips i'm putting in here you guys know before i did not really because you know i had to put the video up before well you guys know what i mean anyway 
Uh, I hope you guys liked the video. If you do, like I said, thumbs up. Subscribe if you haven't. I didn't say that part earlier. Uh, and you know, hope we'll see you on the next one.